be about one people here because obviously football I didn't think that far ahead no. at all no I didn't really because we don't really watch football no neither so. of us watch football um, so there might be zero people here I'm really this sorry this is about so that. insane what I'm like watching the stream while I'm on it record ah! <laughs> sorry okay are you excited by this is actually really cool is it yeah I think it's really cool alright anyway so this idiot is <laughs> Thanks, That's all right. Abu Bakr Salim, who you might know as Bayek from Assassin's Creed. Look who I, celebrity guests. Hello, can you actually hear us? I really hope you can hear us. Oh, oh no. no. Wait, what am I doing? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, we can hear us. Can you hear us? Hello. Can you hear us? Hello, hello. Hi, Pishbot. Hi, I make stuff. Hi, Robert Payne. Hi, Timur. Yes, okay, good. Okay, it was because there was a hello with a question Origins mark, and they were Bayek. like. Origins, yup. Sorry, yep, just yep. repeating everything that what Gorgon. people are saying. You can do that. Can I do that? That's your job He's today. back from the Dura. Ah, oh, cool. Do it. Sorry. No, no, carry on. Keep reading things. This is great. I really like this. Yeah, this keep is, going. That's, keep... That's, that's what I've got so far. That's as far as I've got. Oh. So. Make him say more things. That's what he's here for. <sighs> <laughs> anyway, I thought it'd be really fun because I felt really guilty that obviously I've missed the past couple of streams due to like work and then also... E3 and all that jazz, yeah? So I'm a bit dopey, but here, nonetheless. Hello, Dr. Doxter, how are you? Uh, so yeah, I thought, hence why, celebrity guest, apparently. I am a celebrity. Bayek, what do you think of ancient Greece? I think it's terrible. No, no. I really like it, Go, actually. I brought, oh, yeah, I brought, actually. I brought him a back idea. a gift. Yes, I make stuff I did. I brought him back, I brought this back in my suitcase specifically for him and his giant head. So they were giving these out at E3 if you played Origins. <laughs> I think it really works. Guys, What I do you think? think? I think you should obviously be in the game. What I do think, you think? I think I should be in the game. I think you should. Let's send I a sternly worded gonna, email I'm now. I'm going to send an email Send right a picture now. to Ubisoft Sorry, right now and be like, now. why the hell am I in the game? Like, what's going on? I'm yeah, DLC command. Hi, Hell Quinn. How you doing? Wait, get me in that photo. I'm, I'm the one who makes this happen. I know you are. So meta right now. Um, so, hey, Use Cheeky Monkey, you're not staying long tonight because you've ruptured an eardrum from Ramstein. Dude! Well, actually, if you're going to rupture an eardrum, it probably <laughs> is from Ramstein, let's be honest. Um, yeah, so that's cool. Um, I've also made him choose a Universal Yum Yums box so that we can taste that. But also, you know how I like my food. Um, you know how I was like obsessing about walnut whips the other week, actually every week. He's missed all this, he doesn't know this. What? Um, it's all right, Karen, what you're okay, doing? I'm just telling everyone to come on board because I think they're missing something, right? right really this special. is like amazing. Yeah. Yeah. What are, you, what are you saying about me? I'm telling. I'm saying that I'm streaming with you, and they should watch the football because the football is terrible, guys. Well, it's okay. It's fine. I got. It's the only whip I'm ever gonna get. I live in London. Oh, I don't need a car. So these are my whips. As you can see, I've already eaten one ahead of him being here. Okay. <laughs> um, are you gonna put my Twitch? Like, yeah. How do I? What's your link? Twitch.tv. Jump on at twitch.tv forward slash TV yeah. forward slash. Guess what it is. It's Julia Hardy. Well done. You win a prize. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thank it's you. the helmet I was going to give you anyway. Right. Hello. Oh, okay. Um, oh, Pishbot's um, repping on some Turkish delight this week. Hey, Red Valkyrie, you guessed. You totally guessed. You did. It would be this it is me. idiot on the stream. Um, <laughs> so, um, yeah, I didn't realise there was football tonight because who cares? Um, so yeah, hence why there's probably about like three of us, but never mind. Um, it's an m s walnut whip. So m s do like loads of different kinds of walnut whips and I am completely obsessed. They're good, right? I think they're really tasty. I quite like them. Yeah. I mean, I would I can't take you seriously. Yes, you can. <laughs> I think you should take me seriously right now. I think people should take me seriously with this video. Can you can you take me seriously, guys? Huh? Can you? Huh? Take me seriously. Oh my god, the mint one is amazing. You're so right. Um, Americans don't have them. Um, okay, so Falcon, have you ever had like a moon pie? It's a bit like a moon pie, moon but like, pie. but like, sorry, longer and more coney. Hi, Lord Tea Maker. How you doing? Um, Yes, also Pishbot, uh, M&S do uh, really good tomatoes, but also their strawberries are really nice, because if you get them from Sainsbury's, they can, all, they can be a bit rubbish. Are you I'm gonna, now? No, I'm going to make a story too, so then we can get like crazy people on. But I'm going to have to tell them to come on your thing. Okay, all right. 
Wait, hey guys, I'm streaming with me. Sorry about that. Jump on. <laughs> I'm gonna click it, like post a link on the. Uh, you on look the really thing. silly with that on. You look really silly with that on. I'm just saying that now. Jump on. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm just you know being really cool and stuff. No, you're not. No, I really um, so Red Valkyrie, you can win a prize. You can make him say something in an accent. Yes. Tell him to say something I'll in say, his Bayek accent. I'll say anything. Re will well, you? Not, not anything. Not really. Do you actually want no. another job with you? Yourself? Just be I, careful. I'm really sweating under this helmet. Well, though. take it off. No. <laughs> Sorry. You're scaring Joel with the helmet. Sorry, Joel. Joel, I think... I Say I, hi to Lard Tea Maker. He's saying hi. Hi, Lard Tea Maker. This helmet is slowly looking? moving up. Just take it off. No, I'm not taking this. Okay. I will take this helmet off. Um, La Team Maker says, did you ever have the urge to go full Yorkshire when reading as Bayek? Bayek? <laughs> <laughs> there was a Bayek. point. Get Ooh. to the There was a time where I did actually think, uh, yes, he was from Yorkshire. But then I realised he isn't from Yorkshire. So. Is this a running thing? I don't know. Why have you just... Ah! No! Would you Shush. hurry up and send the tweet? All right, I'm sending it now. Have you put uh, the link oh, in God. it yet? What? Have you put the link in it yet? I'm going to now. I'm going to. Sorry, guys. I'm, I don't He's know how to use... Noob. Can you imagine? I don't know how to use phones. I don't know how to you use phones. You actually don't need no, to use phones. Here we go. It's done. Have you put it's the done. link in it to Twitch? Well, I can't do it on. I can't do it on my thing. It won't let me. Let you me can't link do links because I'm not verified, guys. Huh? Abzi, you sweet, sweet boy. Thank you very much. Well, just type in Twitch.tv forward slash. Just write it in. Yeah, that's what surely. I'm gonna do. That's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. Twitch. Oh. Okay. So, um, hello, Cipher off dear. Um, Buddha zero zero four seven says now I want a Roman Batman. That oh, would be cool. That would be amazing. Uh, That'd be an amazing apparently Akatosh is like Abzi you sweet sweet boy I know I like I like, I like Akatosh Akatosh is cool I wasn't at E3 sadly um, I wish I was I'm really sweating under this but it's would great. you just take it off nope, then no not taking it off it's not going to work sad to he wasn't at E3 got the chance yeah Ash and Alex are a lovely people they're really really cool you can call me Tanya it's Tanya I think you're in there with Tanya oh listen me and Tanya go way back like that's, that's what happens, right? That, yes. When people like each other. Absolutely. Right? Yes. Okay. I need to post this. <laughs> I haven't posted this yet. See, okay, it, anyway, won't, see just, it won't give, do the link. That's fine. But then everyone can just, like, they get it. Okay. It's the same. Anyway. Um, yeah, so that was really good because you went, uh, I ended up going to, well, he wasn't there. Uh, I went to um, the, the Nolan North BAFTA Greatest Achievement Award. And we'd gone there because we are doing an interview for Newsbeat about the award. But I wasn't doing it. Stefan, my weird gaming show husband was doing it and so I was just sitting around but I ended up sitting around with Troy Baker and Nolan North you know just hanging out they're like drinking some whiskey it was really fun uh, and then basically everyone who's anyone from voice acting was there yeah and I got this amazing cool video from them all oh yeah so amazing they were all like giving me their lovely advice which was <laughs> so I asked was okay let me explain exactly go how this happened it. so after I was hanging out with No North, he'd gone like, he was about to go upstairs to go and get ready. I was like, oh, can I ask a favour? I was like, oh, a friend of mine, yeah, he's done a bit of voice acting, but I think it's a bit of a waste of time. Like, he shouldn't, he shouldn't bother. Can you, like, send him a video, basically, like, warning him off going into voice acting? And it's basically a video of him, Troy Baker, Spider-Man, and wait, who was the other one? Tara, Tara, Tara yeah. Platt. Yeah. yeah. Being like, what are you doing? Don't go into voice acting. Which I thought was hilarious. I thought it was brilliant actually I, <laughs> they I were was, like why am i doing this i was I, like just go with it i, I like insulting it. him my life I, in, a, in my life i made it so i really like this helmet this i feel like this helmet is like perfect um it any chance of you appearing sorry i'm just gonna say i'm no, gonna go. appear in okay. uh, comic cons i am actually gonna appear in comic cons hopefully soon i can't tell you when can't tell you how can't admit anything apparently you made um steve google him everett laugh all the way through origins were you intending to make people laugh yes, yes. i was intending to make people laugh me Going through trauma makes people laugh. I mean, I would laugh at your misfortune. Like, I'm if you, sure if you fell laugh. over this couch right now, I would piss myself laughing. Ha! <laughs> ha! Oh, the pain. <coughs> Are you both going to RTX? What's RTX? Tell me what I RTX is. I don't know what that is. Take it off. No, I love it. I really, I'm really liking this at the moment. I feel like okay. I'm going to wear this the whole time. But if you're going to wear it, you can't complain about your head being sweaty all the way through the stream. That's okay. Hi, Kathy is awesome. How are you doing? Hey, Lodestar. How are you doing? Rooster teeth. Jojo. Jo oh. No, but I sh we should. No, we should. How Rooster many, teeth. How many random grunts? I made quite a few grunts and climbing sounds. I think I Come remember. On, make, some, make some grunts. I actually had a... I Red Valkyrie, did you pick something for him to say yet? 
Oh, wow. She did nice. 100% completed. Okay. He will say anything you say because I'll make Absolute. him. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Favorite game V3. Um, grab the creepy thing from over there. Okay. Um, so it has to be Cyberpunk. They gave away this super creepy statuette with it. I don't know if you can really see it. Look how I tried to get it back without it getting dented, but it was quite hard. I mean, because I had that. In my, I basically had no room for clothes. It was like this helmet and this thing here. Look at that. So basically, only the people who got to play um, behind closed doors. Well, no, we didn't play. We just watched a gameplay video. I'm going to put up um, a video on YouTube tomorrow of like all of my thoughts and roundup ideas and whatever, and I go fairly in depth. I don't want to bore you right now with it. Cyberpunk. Anyway, hello, Dr. Murdoch. Right. Phone um, is away now, so you have my full attention because I've advertised enough. Okay. Hopefully, my Assassin's Creed people. people will come. Hello, people. How is everyone doing? Okay, she says, please say, go to bed and then get out of bed. Apparently. Go to bed. Get out of bed. <laughs> <laughs> Go to bed. Get out of bed. Oh, I see what you're doing right now. You're making an alarm. So you have me telling you to go to bed and to get out of bed. Clever. Sorry, okay, go on. That's all right. Um, yes, we do have snacks today. Um, Abu, which box did you pick? Oh, yes, I picked, a, I picked snacks. Okay, guys, quick question. <laughs> Where was Picasso born? Do we need to make the thinking music? Da, na, na, na. It's the Jeopardy music. Na, 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 na. And we don't have to, but I'm making it. Oh, Red Valkyrie says maybe. That's a yes. <laughs> yep, in hospital. Okay, I'm not going to... Spain, in hospital Spain. Snacks. Guys, hospital snacks, really? Ha! Spain! That is... Is it correct? Correct. Is this like my hair attached That's to it? <laughs> hair attached to the fucking thing. Right. Span. Span. So this is where the snacks are. The yum yeah. box. So Malaga, Spain. Wow. Okay. People are really good at detail. I am. We don't know. So you've never done one of these before. No, right? I haven't. I've not done any of these. So the, the Monday Night Crew are into the snacks vibe as well. Um, I've done some of these on stream before. I've done some of them on YouTube before. But basically, it's you, you get like a little scorecard with it, and then it gives you some like fun, exciting a scorecard. Yeah, facts about like where the snacks come from, or like why they're made this way, or whatever. It's, oh wow! There's like a little booklet, which generally you end up just reading out loud in funny voices to, I don't know, because your mouth is full of crisps. Don't look at me like that. Uh -huh. day. Um, really... Okay, so here's the scorecard. Oh my god. Welcome to Spain. Okay. Here we are. So, um, yeah, you get, have a little look. Wow. This is really interesting. Mm hmm This is like the official Yum Awards. Okay. So these are all the ones that are going to be in the box. And then each one has like a little fact sheet. Fun times. This is really Like some of the other ones were like... Mr. Sanchez or whatever. When right. he was originally making taffy in Fort Lauderdale, uh, he once stumbled <laughs> upon a box and inside it's like these really lengthy stories and you're like, it's bloody crisps. <laughs> so skip to the end. <laughs> Wait, let me see if I can find like... How did people fight in these helmets? I mean, it's just so... Well, I mean, I think they were a little bit more concerned Sorry. about like yes, not having was... their face hacked I mean, off rather than it being comfortable. It's not really great. Well, I mean, it's going to stop, hopefully, someone cutting your head off or smashing your head in. Just cut it from my neck. Well, maybe you wear, need, need to wear, like, a collar. Okay. Did, I, did, I didn't know about Odyssey. I had no idea. Or did I? <laughs> oh, NDAs. <laughs> okay, right, let's start at the beginning. What's the first? Abu is perfect, by the way. Go on. Cassandra all the way. Sorry. Cassava! <laughs> Sorry, okay. That's right. Let's start off with La Abuela Nev Artisan Potato Chips. Okay. The Iberian ham flavoured crisps. Okay. So what we need to do is, okay, so on each of these, if you haven't seen this before, has a little scorecard, like that. I mean, it's... And then you pick your faves. So what colour pen do you want? Oh, I will take... Uh, is this... What is this? Magenta. <laughs> wow, there's a reason why that is... Hilarious, guys. Let's not go into it. Uh. <laughs> anyway. I didn't do anything. You didn't do anything, it's fine. Um, there's like three people in the world who'll get that joke. Right, let's start off with the um, crisps. Iberian ham flavoured crisps. Here we go. Oh, wait, here we are. I was looking at the wrong thing. 
ham. Do you like ham? No. Okay, well then you're not going to like these, then are you? <laughs> right. Oh, the snack gel. The snack thing is called Universal Yum Yums and it's basically kind of like a monthly subscription box and every month it goes to like a different country in the world. Have a sniff of that. Can you sniff it through the helmet? Sweet Jesus, mother of Mary. Th these aren't the worst smelling crisps, I have to say. So here we go. Right, I'm going to read you a little story about some crisps while you, while you taste them. So, okay, I t tend to do it out of five and I do accept half points. Okay. Okay, deadly stuff wants your helmet. Well, that doesn't sound that Guys, this is, I think this is like suitable for vegetarians. How little ham has there got to be in there for that? This is, this is amazing. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> it's like right. suitable for vegetarians. Anyway, okay, right, go on. Anyway, right. Sorry. Okay. Continue. I'm, I'm going to come in close for this. Visiting Spain without having a bite of ham? It's unheard of. Ham is the crown jewel. <laughs> I can't do it. Ham is the crown jewel of traditional Spanish cuisine. Featured everywhere from tapas plates to breakfast table. You can't even fit it under your helmet. We need to stop saying helmet out loud. Um, you can't walk through the streets of Spain without seeing dozens of ham legs hanging from butcher shop windows. Among the countless varieties of speciality Spanish hams is one that's considered the best of the best, and that is the Iberian ham. This delicacy is made with meat from Iberico hogs, which are fed a special diet of acorns and acorns and olives. The meat is cured for up to three years. Talk about patience! Exclamation mark. The result is a complex, intense flavour with an unparalleled sweetness. We had to give you a taste, but fortunately for the Iberico hogs, there's no meat in this recipe. <laughs> Instead, you. Oh my god, your head is actually wet. I told I'm you. so sweaty. You need me to get like a fan. It was the ham. And the... the ham made you. Is there like. Ugh, I'll put the helmet back on later. But wow. bloody hell, that was a really. Do you, do you like these crisps? I mean. It was sweat. my intense voiceover reading that was obviously doing it to you. Um, we had to give you a taste, but fortunately for the Iberico hogs, there's no meat in this recipe. Instead, you get the bold, full-blooded flavour of the Iberian ham mixed with crispy, thin potatoes. Just try not to hog the whole bag. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding? So what do you think, out of five? Give me a ham. Give me a ham, Chris. Give me a ham, non-ham. Um. It looks like you're sweating because they're awful and it makes me not want to eat them. Ugh. I mean, it's suitable for vegetarians, so... It just tastes like a hammy crisp. I don't... <laughs> Is it out of five? It's out of five, I accept half points. I mean, I would eat these, but it's quite synthetic. I mean, oh, yeah. not that, like, crisps taste really pathetic. I'd say two. Really? Yeah. Wow. Uh, two implies that you wouldn't eat the whole bag. No, I wouldn't. Two out of five, then. Let's do it. Uh, Wait, do we send these back to them or is this just for our sick <laughs> no, pleasure? No, no, we just for us. Okay. Okay, so ignore this. Just put your score in the first one and I'll okay. put mine in the one. Okay, so two. out two. of five. Oh, well, yeah, we, know, we assume it's out of five, it's fine. I would say 2.5 because we have had better crisps. Okay. I saw some of those tacky fuegos, but I was like, you, Julia, you cannot fill up your suitcase full of crisps. That's obscene. Although hey, I Claudia. Um, See, my AC crew, AC crew, you know AC what's crew. cool. Yeah. We've got some olive like oil step. cookies now, whatever the frick that is. Let's take a little quick look, shall we? Here we are. What are these? Olive oil cookies. Olive oil cookies? All right, you can read this one out in a stupid voice. Olive. <clears throat> olive oil cook in a cookie. Hey, don't knock it till you try it. And I buy feel it. like Bayek should start doing some more adverts. I think he really should. <laughs> <laughs> Don't knock it till you try it. Okay. And buy it. Says. We mean, says Bayek. <laughs> okay. We mean Spanish olive oil. This still smell like olive oil and olives. Olive oils. No, olives were first bought in. Uh, no, wait. I how did you buy it? I don't know how I did this, this joke! <laughs> How many pages did you have to read? Quite a few. No. <clears throat> oh, it's quite nice. Olives were first, first bought to Spain in 1050 BC, but it was the Romans who That's began the cultivation of the trees throughout the country, calling the... You know, I'm sorry, guys. It's been a while, okay? Calling the oil liquid gold. I think, Today, they, might be, I think they might be overselling it, if I'm honest, but... <laughs> I know, right? 
Today, there are 300 million olive trees across Spain, producing some of the highest quality in the oil. Oil in the... Why can't I... Re which certainly you lives are fucking up to it. Job to Roman I know! <laughs> Was this the best worst idea ever? Try and try something. Now. I don't know why I agreed to this. I don't know why you agreed to it either. Basically, it's supposed to be as good as the people of Spain are at making liquid gold. What? They're even better at eating it. Whether it's drizzled, over salad, or used to marinate meat, Spanish olive oil is incorporated into nearly every traditional dish. Our favourite use? These chewy Spanish tortas! The olive oil is baked with cinnamon, almonds, and... An and is that anise? Well... Anise? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's what that weird flavour is. Oh. Um, where was it? Lard Tea Maker says, can you say, um, yes, I can hear you, Clem Pandak. So, you haven't watched Toast yet, have you? No, I haven't. You won't get that joke. Yes, what? I can hear you, Clem Fandango. Say it's Bayek. Yes, I can hear you, Clem Fandango. <laughs> Crossover mashup. up. <laughs> mm. Mm. Amazing. Hi, Commander James Bond. How are you doing? Mm. Um, you're like, don't know what's happening. Okay, we're doing a Universal Yum Yum's Damn. box. Hey, Deadly Jeff. Words, what are they? It's weird, right? The, it's, the, it's, like the, it's like fennel or anise or whatever the hell that is. It's got that kind of tw weird twang to it. Well, I like it, you know. You quite like it, you know. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's a bit odd. But you like, you're a fan of a cookie, right? I like cookies. You do like cookies. Cookies are great. Cookies. What's your favourite cookie? Okay, guys. I, I know the answer to this because he's told me about 12 times. I've told everyone. I'm going to blow your minds and you've got to do this. Okay? So, if you're from London and you live in London or England. No, it's, they're not, it's not just from London. They have them all over the country. Well, well yeah. In England, right? Right from England. Anyway, before I was really interrupted, I was about, I'm about to share some serious like knowledge to you people. I'll just sit back and carry on. Pretz mm -hmm. chocolate cookies. Right? They're vegan almond butter chocolate cookies. They are the best cookies I have ever eaten in my life. I would kill for those cookies. I have killed for those cookies. <laughs> wow. Pret chocolate cookies. They are nice. They're amazing. But like Falcon's right, Ben's cookies, I prefer, they're quite depthy. They're quite girthy and quite thick. Who doesn't love that? Wow. You haven't been on my stream before, it gets weird. Oh my worry. God. <laughs> <laughs> right, what's the mark out of five? Get your magenta pen. I would. <laughs> I'd give it a three. All right. Because it's really quite dry. It's quite and dry. And you have to really work at it. You know, olive oil is normally supposed to be something that's really I quiet. mean, cookies should be moist. <laughs> they should be moist! I know that sounds wrong, but I'm right. Girthy and thick. Oh, not just England. Ooh, Costa Tiffin. Oh, really? Tiffin? Mm. Wow, okay. Mm. Girthy and thick is good. Thanks, Commander moist. James Bond, of course. <laughs> that's such a horrible word! Keep it moist, guys. Oh. Yeah, yeah, just keep it moist. Everyone, everyone, everyone wants our cookie to be moist. Regret that later, Twitch. <sighs> oh, okay, these might be good. What are these? La Casitos Gold. Oh, wait, I haven't given it a score. Oh, I'm going to say two. I was not that excited what? by it. You gave those freaking ham crisps I, more than the I cookie? judge sweet things much harsher, harsher than I judge crisps. Okay, it's just who I am. You can't change me. I will. Oh, I thought these were going to be like gooey, but they look like, they kind of look a bit like Smarties. I got the worst hands for doing this. Don't look at my hands. <laughs> okay, you get into that. Okay. I'm, going to, I'm going to read it out loud. Um, what, let's do posh voice. Okay. If you were looking for gold 2,000 years ago, Spain was a pretty good place to find it. In the northern province of Lyon. Tiny flecks of gold flowed through the cheeks and rivers, Maybe and prospectors searching for deposits. Okay. Ooh, quickly took over the region. During the time of the Roman Empire, sophisticated canals oh were built that could dislodge rock materials in water. It's like way too much information. And exposed the treasure. Everything sounds a bit wrong now. Um, if you're looking for gold in Spain today, then we've got news for you. We've found it for you. Open up the gold tube and you'll find a chocolate gold mine. Not only is the colour of the candy gold, but the insides too. Is it gold on the inside? These are like confused M&Ms. Is it? Is it having it's a like bit they don't know what they are. 
Sorry, continue. It's right. With your posh voice. Thank you. Uh, with a sweet buttery flavour and a light crispy crunch, this is the gold standard of candy. Unfortunately, this kind of gold won't make you rich, but it sure will make your taste buds happy. Do you feel happier now that you've eaten that? Give they are confused. They are confused M&Ms. Right, okay, let's, let's do, let's do a cross confused. section, hon. So yeah, it's white and five. They're basically like Smarties, but like... See what I mean by confused mm. M&Ms? Yes, I would love to voice a character in Star Wars. Go on. It's a bit like if Werther's original made a Smartie. Right? It's yeah. It's that like creamy thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean... It's weird because you're expecting it to taste like Smartie, but actually it's just... It's like a weird skittle. Why don't I make it orange? I'm expecting oranginess. It's gold. That ain't, go that ain't gold. Judgmental. Okay, my vote on it would be... I'd give it a two, man. It's a confused ass smarty. Yeah, but that's you're coming with your preconceptions about what it should be and not just taking it What's on face that? value. Alright, no, score it how you like, score it how you like. <laughs> you just gave the cookie a two. It had weird, like, star and, like, a nice... It was an all right cookie! I'm not going to do this with someone else again. No. I'm going to give this a three. Because they're actually very tasty. Oh, wow. You, you just... Wait, really? Yes. Wow, okay. I'm not judging. But he is. Right, what's next? Whatever that, that thing is. Here we go. Montecado Double de Limon. I got this. Right, come on. Fuck me! Sorry. Try not to swear by man. Look at the size of it. It's bloody huge. What is it? Wow. Look at the size of that! That's because it's a lemon shortbread cookies. No idea what you're holding in your hands? I don't have any idea what I'm holding in my hands. Tell me more. Well, it's only Spain's most sought after treat. <gasps> it isn't. Mantequenta means butter in Spanish. Who so knew? You can guess what the main ingredient of this dessert is. Cheese. Okay. What's harder to guess is exactly what it is. Cake? Cookie? Something in between. <laughs> the story of this sweet started over 500 years ago in oh, the God, southern city of Estepa. At the time, the region was producing a surplus of butter and wheat. Originally, uh, nuns in Estepa... What the... Why, why are we getting into nuns now? Is this a I cookie? I don't know. I know. They go really deep in this. It's like, weird. What is the... It's just a cookie. Yeah. They like to... They like to... They have a backstory a lot in uh, Universal Yamams. It's quite funny. Okay. <sighs> right, okay, okay. But in 1870, a businesswoman named... Oh, come on, guys. What? Let me read it. Filomena Ruiz de Lez. Filomena Ruiz de Lez. Okay. Filomena Ruiz de Lez. There's something different. She made the nuns butter cakes. Damn, you did, girl. Did but they? Changed... She, 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 she bought her cakes. Oh. But change the recipe by drying them in the oven, which turned them no into crumbly tender. No one likes a dry tender. cookie. No one. It, we had this conversation about moistness earlier. Right. Look, they even—they're not even helping themselves. These dried cookies could travel much farther do and quite, didn't grow look, mold look as this. quickly as the nun's moist butter cookies. Look at that! It's like sand. I'm gonna eat a bit while you're talking. <sighs> oh my god! Is that people like eating sand? <laughs> Her husband travelled across Spain selling them, turning Mrs. Why? Lez Why did you do that? Why would I could just get sand off the floor? Why would I buy it from that this guy? Is ridiculous. Apparently, they're, they're really <laughs> sought after cookies, though. Today, over 40 so million pounds. So she's the man who made them. Just, I'm eating sand. It's, it doesn't look nice I'm at all. I'm eating literal sand right now. Why do people do this to themselves? Sorry, carry on. Today, over 40 million pounds of mantecadeo are made in Estapa region of Spain each year, including the special lemon variety you hold in your hands. Or kind of hold in your hands. Because it They're... falls apart! That's exactly it! They're very, very crumbly. That's not selling it. So here's, the, here's something that was made that nuns like. Let's be honest, nuns have no frame of reference about anything. Well, they don't! They're nuns! Do they get amazing chocolate cheesecake? No, probably not. God doesn't I've want them to be happy. i bad nuns in my time. Have you? No, I really haven't. Oh. I 
every hymn. You're going to regret that much. Oh, my God. What the... <laughs> oh, God. Oh. Buddha, Buddha, you're right. Maybe he's really good at selling Zen because this is... Look, look. Oh, my look at this. God. I can't even pick it up. Oh, what is that? <laughs> I don't know. There's, there's nothing right about it. Like, the texture is disgusting. The flavour is pretty gross. Like, is this one of those things that was just, like, popular because everyone used to have it, like, at Christmas or something and then they just keep on eating it? You know what I mean? Yeah. No. Oh god, no. that is terrible. No. We don't approve of that. Screw you and your nun sand selling. Mm. <laughs> I mean, they're not all. This was supposed to be. Great they're not snacks. all great. Some of them are just weird. Some of them are just weird, like life and boyfriends. Just weird sometimes. Just weird. Right, what's next? I feel like okay. What you? Get? I'm going to give that. I'm gonna give that a 0.5. I'm not. I'm not feeling it at all. It just tastes like crap. Yeah, that's that's a zero for me, man. Give it a zero. You are well within a right. Right. Next up. Magenta pen. I don't know what. Uh -huh. I'm magenta it. pen. Don't lose that. Ooh. So this next one is Leticias Naranja al Chocolate. Chocolate covered candied oranges. Raid. What's a raid? Raid. Frankie raid. Oh my god, there's a raid. Mommy to raid. What's going on with raid? Hey, Frankie, how raid. you doing? Wait, is this Frankie, Frankie, Frankie? Frankie Twitch, Frankie. Um, oh, her, sorry. That's Frankie. America. Are you androids, Frankie? Are we That's... androids? Yes. Wait. Hello, Frankie, hello. Frankie, Frankie, Frankie. Oh, hi, Frankie. How are you doing? Which Frankie is this? It's Twitch Frankie. You've, you've clearly met her at some point. There's no way you haven't met Frankie. She's like beautiful, curly hair. I must have met Frankie. Frankie sounds really familiar. You have, you've met her definitely. Hello. Yes. Frankie what? Formerly Twitch Frankie. FTF. Nope. Nope. Anyway. Wait, Frankie, have you left Twitch? When did that happen? Did that happen? I've missed things. I'm really sorry if that's the case. But if you are formerly off Twitch. Um, me, 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 me. Um, you're only Annie Mac. Yes, I mean she has very similar hair to Annie Mac. Um, okay, right. Are you ready for this next one? What is this? It's candied oranges. What? Candied oranges. Candied oranges. You have to say it like this. Candied oranges. It gets a bit weird. Isn't it? Candied oranges. Oh, sorry, Frankie. I didn't realise. But yeah. Well, cool. Hey, she's Frankie. Been, she's what? been killing it hosting. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, yeah. sick. Nice. Okay, I'm going to read you this nonsense. Okay, go for it while I eat my candied orange. Pack your bags, because we've headed to Valencia. Situated on the beautiful eastern coast, the orchard of Spain grows the best you, oranges in Europe. Doing? I don't even know. Big, round, sweet... It'll change from at least three different accents as we go through it. Big, round, sweet oranges from Valencia are sought after throughout Spain and beyond. But before the orchards export their oranges, they like to keep the best ones for themselves. The bastards. Only the smallest, sweetest, and juiciest fruit that they hoard, and that's what they, and that's what you get to try with this candy. You know what's even better than oranges straight from Valencia? Okay. Um, oranges um, straight from Terry's chocolate orange. Actually, yeah, that would be a better answer than this. Oranges covered in a thick layer of bittersweet chocolate. The bright citrus fruit flavour balances perfectly with the creamy chocolate for a treat so good you'll want another immediately. Orange, we glad we introduced you to. God, it's like my dad wrote these. You know what, right? Is it good? That's not bad. Is that good? That's like what Terry's Chocolate Orange wanted to be. Is it though? Became better. You know what I mean? Mm. Oh, bye, Frankie. Frankie's gone. Bye, bye. Um, Mmm, this is good. I like this one. I think it's pretty good. It's not better than Terry Chocolate Orange, don't you? No, that's what I mean by like, Terry Chocolate Orange tried to be that, but then they were like, actually, we're better. At the PUBG party at E3, they had churros, right? Churros. Wow. Circular churros. Um, oh my God, at the skies! Subscribe, you have to do a little, little dance. You have to do it. Just sub, you sub, thank you, you're the best. Because I don't have any like cheer, like anything good that I can do on the channel because I'm rubbish, so I just dance instead. Well, that Tell him he's one. the best. You're the best. That's all right, isn't it? So, churros, mm. and then they come in the big pot of melted chocolate to dunk them in, but chocolate orange flavour. 
Oh, my God, dear Lord. I, I'm not sure if I drank or ate more at the PUBG party. That's amazing. It was pretty good. Toro, what's up? How you doing? Uh oh. Toro is one of the uh, mods on Assassin's Creed on Reddit. Oh. He's really cool. He's a hey, guy. how you doing? He's a really good guy. Um, He's a really lovely guy. This is the best thing so far. Would mm. you agree? Yes. I would give that a four. Ooh. Because Terry's Chocolate know. Orange are a five. I am going to give it. I'm going to give it a four as well. I'm going to go there. <laughs> he looks like he's working out an escape plan. That is so true. I was looking down to see if there was a way out, but there wasn't. No, I've chained him to the sofa. Is Your one. Okay. Oh, I like this. It's like they're a version of those weird, like, you know, there's like uh, crisp mixes that they do at M&S that are like lots of weird shapes. Oh, yeah. It's like that. But they're corn. It's corn. Corn's great. Snack mix. Snack mm -hmm. mix. Barbecue flavor. Barbecue flavor. Barbecue flavor. Most people go to a bar to get away from family. But in Spain, they do the opposite. They bring their family to the bar. That sounds like my family, if I'm honest. <laughs> Unlike the bar scenes in other cultures, Spanish bars are considered places to gather and socialize with family throughout all hours of the day, not just at night. This is great. And for those who don't drink, there's still another reason to go to the bar. The snacks. I mean, that is a reason. That's a good reason. Specifically, the corn nuts. Ba -do, ba -do. Served in bottomless about? bowls and eaten by the ha by the handful, these crunchy fried corn kernels are the definition of bar food in Spain. Oh, damn. Plus, a whole lot more. Is there? What else can you say about corn bar snacks? Rice puffs and salty corn chips complement the corn nuts for a one-of-a-kind snack mix when you decide to eat... Damn! That's very barbecue, wow. right? Right? Wow. Please anyway. say moist in the voice. Please say moist cookies. Say moist it. cookies. Do it closer to the mic. Do it. Go on. Moist cookies. <laughs> Does anyone have any ringtones they need? There we go. <laughs> hey. Oh, have you finished? Oh, no, wait. Um, <clears throat> whether you decide to eat these with family, with alcohol, or both, or neither... We think after one bite, you'll understand why the Spaniards love them as much as they do. Potatoes mix, cocktail, they mix that. Want to try some? Yeah, for sure. Mm. They're all right. Quite Bam! Fan. I'm quite a fan of corn snacks. Corn snacks? I love corn. Oh, shit. <laughs> just oh, God. Over the oh, oh, oops. Oh, no. No! Hey, why are you round to my flat? You I'm just dropped them all over the floor. Sorry. What's wrong with you? I'm so... Don't eat them off the floor. You have no idea what's oh, going on there. Oh, oh my god, these are amazing. These are really good, right? Oh my god. Right? Fucking hell. I mean, I mean sorry. It's all right. We all have days. Mm. This is amazing. These are really, really, these really are good. These are tasty as hell. Yeah. They're bottomless in Spain? I've got to go to Spain more. I feel like they'd have like, like a more terrible version of that. Oh. But th oh. those ones on the bar will probably have like pee in them. You know, they do that thing with like testing how much pee is in peanuts <laughs> oh, on yeah. the bar. And the answer is a lot. Oh, oh no! Stop dropping them on the floor! Oh, hurry! Okay, Cypher Offty says, Oh my god, now I want to send you snacks, Abzi. Hi, Anomi! Oh, Hi, Daniel. This is Abu, who does Bayek and some other shit. Hello! Like, like TV stuff, but no one watches that. Hello! Yeah, no one watches me on TV. No. What are you shooting at the moment? At the moment, I'm shooting Jamestown in Budapest. Where I play Slave. What? Where I play Pedro. Yeah? Who's a slave. But he's actually a really cool guy. I really like him. One day, um, Abu will be allowed to actually act in his own accent. Cipher of Tear. Like a teardrop. But you can call oh. it Tanya. Cipher of Tear. Oh, I see. Sorry. Sorry, Tanya. <laughs> Um, I tried to watch Jamestown, homie, but your season ain't up. No, it isn't. I'm in two, season right? two. I come up in season two. Yep. While I'm eating these delicious snacks. Hey, Katie! Um, 
Oh, um, I think Red Valkyrie said she accidentally deleted her oh. new alarm. Are you ready? Okay, we're gonna count you no, in. No, I'll do it closer to the thing as well. Yeah, hold on a minute. Are you ready? <clears throat> Can we record it? We've eaten all of these. It's a damn good. Oh, it was get into bed and get out of bed. I think. Oh yeah. Go to bed. Get out of bed. And then do like a funny one about something else. Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, to be fair, that's his approach. Do you want to finish them off? We've, like, yeah, smashed cool. them. Yeah, I think we have. That's got to be a five. Black Mirror was a hell of a lot of fun. I made a very close friend on there called Michaela. She's awesome. And uh, it was just ridiculous. Oh, that was the one where you're, like, a guard or whatever, yeah, right? Yeah, I played. With um, Bryce. Yeah. Bryce Charles Howard. Yeah. What was she like? Bryce was... She was great. No, nah, I'm joking. She was lovely. She was really cool. It's kind of crazy, but great. All the best girls are crazy. Um, mm. So we can't say it's anything less than a five because we... Stop eating them off the floor. You don't. You've never been here. You don't know what my floor's like. Don't care. It's still good. I feel like I should tell him what's been happening on the floor, but... <laughs> He'll find out when he goes to the doctor. So, um... I'm going to give that a five. Yeah, that was a five. All my best girlfriends have been bad. Well, Why would you want a normal girlfriend? Why wouldn't you want not someone that's like a bit more exciting? That's, that's, can I give it a six? No, it's out of five. Five. Point something? No. Food for just adds a little extra flavour. Thank you, you're so right. right. That's one way of right. That's where I recognise you from. That amazing episode of Black Mirror. Yes! Thank you. Do the voice for that. Excuse me, ma'am. Watch yourself, ma'am. Ma'am. In order to remain calm, I'm evoking my authority as airport security to dock you one full ranking point as a punitive measure. This is a temporary measure. I don't believe I remember this speech. I did it like three, three, four years ago. Apparently you did. Okay. Apparently you did. I'm giving it a five star because it's awesome. Okay, we're now going to eat shiki shin. Oh, why are you doing this? Why don't we just end on that, man? It's a potato snack. It can't be that terrible. Okay, you ready, you ready for the story? Okay. Get comfy. All right. Okay. Right. What? <clears throat> Shikishin barbacoa. Okay. For some Americans, summer means visiting the beach. For others, it means attending baseball games. But for most, summer means it's time for the barbecue. Juicy hamburger patties. Saucy ribs. I like a saucy rib. Charred chicken. Barbecued meats have become a quintessential part of American culture, although they probably don't use the word quintessential. But contrary to popular belief, barbecue is not an American invention. <gasps> what? It's not an American invention. Wait for it. Centuries ago in Barbados, a native tribe called the Tainos used large fire pits to cook their food. They would marinate their meats with tropical spices. What's a tropical spice? That sounds like weird. Then slow roast them atop layers of fig leaves. This style of cooking, which is called barabiku, or sacred fire pit, was superb at enhancing flavor and preserving food after cooking. Early Spanish explorers quickly adopted the technique, calling it barbacoa, a term which would eventually become broader in meaning to apply to food slowly cooked over an open fire. As they traveled north, the explorers spread barbacoa you're actually leaving me any of them. Oh, whoa. These do not smell like barbecue. Uh, America says, like Virginia and the Carolinas. It may be a bit early for the season, but good old American barbecue. But this snack is more than makes up for it. Packed with all the bold, meaty flavour that Spanish barbacoa is known for. These fluffy crisps are a big bite of summer in the middle of spring. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. He's eaten all of them. They're really tasty. They don't look like they should taste of anything. Yeah, there aren't any left. There's like three. Um, tasty though. There's one on the floor. They are, they are the texture of like you know if you're going to like really big Sainsbury's and they have like the international food aisles and they have those really amazing um like chili and lemon crisps. They have got the texture of that. But they never really taste them anything. I think they taste really good. Of what? Cloud. Yeah. Like airy, like. No airy, but it taste for anything. If you ate that, would you be like, wow, that's barbecue? No, I wouldn't. But it's tasty. 
You and eat? yes, I do do theatre, by the way. But I think they're tasty. Theatre. I don't waste food. Exactly. See, they know I don't waste food. I leave it off the floor if need. It wasn't going to be wasted. I hadn't had the chance to taste it yet. You just ate it all. You seem to go to m a lot. <laughs> That's so, so true. You don't know me. I don't know you. So, what was the, was the making matters worse? What do you think about these out of five? I'd give them a four. I was, a bloody four? Yeah, I really like them. I'd give them a four. Well, you are. With they my do look like acid Yeah. I'm going to give that a three. Okay, right. Thank God, I've got one thing left. <sighs> right. So Is next... there one thing left? Yeah. There's two things, right? I've got these. Okay, they're like this... hard sweets, though. Is this yum bay? <laughs> yum bay. Okay, so this is a pistachio toffee. Okay. And then this one is chocolate with pine nuts. I've got to give the story, though, don't I? Yes, you can if you want to. Okay. Right, let's go. <clears throat> Tell us the history of pistachios. Well, I eat does. them. So, yeah, it does. I think the helmet goes with the shirt, don't you? I think it works. You have one shirt. What the hell is that? It's quite squishy, as you can tell. Oh, my it. God. Anyway. <clears throat> it's important they know the texture. It's peak flowery season in Spain this month. But we're not talking about tulips and daisies. We're talking about pistachios. This is pistachios. actually really nice. This is really What is tasty. that? Is that the pistachio one? Yeah, that one. Pistachio trees have been flowering for centuries as far back as 7,000 BC to be exact. <laughs> Rising in sunny climates, the trees were first cultivated in Spain around 3780. Spanish royalty enjoyed the nuts and they surely had a change in the past. That is just straight up nonsense what you're saying. What are you doing? Pistachios are beloved across the country. For their deep, nutty flavor and balance and sweet and salty. Can anyone else understand this? Because I'm sitting right next to it. And I'm sorry. We just gave me the rest of black yards. I bet that. Yeah. Okay, I'll do the next one, bang. <clears throat> okay. Chocolate and nuts always seem to go well together. Oh my god! But <laughs> this month, we're nuts to bring you the classic combination. Why? It really broke nice. the bank. Pine nuts are some of the most expensive nuts on earth. Pine nuts <laughs> come from pine cones. Who knew? It must be extracted by hand after removing two layers of hard outer shell. Next time you're in the forest, you can partake in the labor-intensive ritual, but beware that there are only about 20 species of pine trees. For well, they were born in the darkness. <laughs> that have pine nuts large enough to warrant harvesting. Fortunately, with these candies, you don't have to worry about doing any work or how much they cost. Just sit back, relax, <laughs> and enjoy the rich, buttery taste of pine nuts in every chocolatey bite. <laughs> I Okay, well, try them. Hmm. I'm gonna score mine. Okay, I'm gonna taste mine now. So okay, this so that's, is the, that's the pine nut one. This is the pine nut one. Mm-hmm. Pine nut. Oh. Okay. It's just I like mean, a chewy. Um. A... Yeah. Like um, like an it, it has the texture of like a chocolate eclair. Ah. Like the sweets, not the actual pastry things. No, yeah, what is that? Marks out five. I'd give that a three. Okay. Folklore. Folklore. Falcor! Oh. Just stick it in your mouth. Oh Oops. my god. It's oh. weird, but wait no, for it. Good. But wait for it. Mm. Suddenly. Mm. No, I like that. No, I really like. I give that a five. Five. Mm. Okay. Mm. Right. You no, know, chewing is not good in this helmet. I don't think anything is good in that helmet. Just take it. You're gonna have a really sweaty head again. Oh. Yeah. Oh. It's, it's really sweaty. Oh. 
Oh my god. I mean, we were talking about moist things earlier, but uh, that's not really what I had in mind. I'm fine. I'm just really hot. It's because you fucking put a bloody helmet on your head. I'm done. Do you want to know? Do you want to know what the best we've got? The scores are final now. It's finished. Yes. Yeah. Let's do it. So I mean, I think we know what the winner is because it's that one. It's the cocktail mix. What was it called? Pontazos mix. These were great. But also, you gave a five to the pistachio sweet as well. Well, I give that a five star. So it's this one then. That's the winner. And the one that we like, dislike the most. Oh, don't even. Don't even. Was the creepy, don't creepy even. lemon sand. made by nuns. It's like, you know those like things I have at Hamleys that like those sand kits that kids play with and then it just like... Ugh. That's the kind of stuff that you send to your worst enemy. Well, I don't know about that. And you hope that they inhale it and die. I mean, if you put some poison in that, maybe, but like... That is poison. It's not that bad. There's worse things you could send an enemy. Would you like a nice sweet now? Oh. The cool whip. Cool whip? Yes. Okay. So we're going to get him to try one of these M&S... No, one, no many places do blow and worn up whips, you know. M&S is like obsessed with them. But I also love that. So this is a salted caramel whip. Um, they have other flavours. And we'll see this, this. You can mark this out of whatever you like. Are you ready? That's good, right? That's really Look nice. at the texture of it in five, it's weird. Cool fit. Does not still win. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm never giving you another walnut whip. I mean, it was very tasty. Whip again. It was tasty. It's called a walnut whip. So the corn, so the caramel, more not whip. Mm. It's like a marshmallowy thing in the middle. Whip. Yeah, it's not really cream. It's more like marshmallow, right? Mm. Mm. Like a soft mallow. Oh, that whip! I just said it on me. Uh huh. I ain't sharing any. Get your own. I don't get all questions in my stream. Sorry. That was actually, no, actually, you know what? They're really good. It just keeps giving. It does. And then you get to the end and then you're like, I wish I had 12 more. If, yeah. I, if that was a 12 pack, I would eat every one. Yeah. Mm. Damn. What? It's like Christmas sweets away before. Just like every other Monday. I'm drinking some water. Oh yeah, how's that going? Wow. Five. Five. Um, we could play some video games if you want. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Should we play some games? Yeah. Let's play some games. All right. Can do that. All right. Let's get all these snacks out of the way. Like, that was like one of those Volkswagen ads. No. where it's like, shh. <laughs> okay. Right. Well, team, um, have you played much Detroit? I haven't played Detroit. Um, I've always I've wanted to. I've heard really good things about it. But um, I am looking forward to it. We're not playing Assassin's Creed, guys, because... I don't like it. I think it's awful. What? like the worst thing I've ever played my whole life. Ah, oh, boy. <laughs> Go to bed, boy. You just got a new subscriber. Ah, oh, Buddha. Buddha is the best. Thanks for the subscription. You are the best. See? Winner, winner. Boy. Boy. We're hunting deer. Do you want to play? Do you want to play it? Detroit Come Human? Yeah, do you want okay. to play it? Let's go. Oh. Fuck. You must update to use network features. Well, you didn't I don't prepare this, did you? I don't want to play you any network. I don't want any network features. Oh, I don't okay. need them. Oh, okay. 
I'm still playing this, so going to dip out so I don't get spoiled. Okay. Thanks. Oh, okay, fair enough. That's completely understandable. Thanks for joining us, Daniel. Yeah, see you later, darling. Take care. Boy. Oh, no, nah, no. Nah. Oh, damn. Look at her. What's she saying? Hey, girl. Oops. I think your saved game is corrupted. No way. Just You'll kidding. fix it. <laughs> She's funny. She's a bitch. What's your number? Sorry. Press that one. Do I just press X? Yeah. Do I press X? Yes, you do. Okay. Play equals updates. What's that mean? Play equals updates. What? It's not English. Loading. How do you feel after all those snacks? I feel quite full. Yeah. You're still a bit sweaty. I'm still quite sweaty. It's because of the, the the helmet. I don't want anyone telling me who my save is corrupted, no matter how. Exactly, but uh, that, was, that was not cute, what she was saying at all. Whoa. Okay. Here we are. I, I can't remember what happened last time. So I'll just have to guess. Okay. So you're basically playing as all these different characters, right? This guy's... From what we can ascertain, is pretty abusive. Like, the game starts with her coming back after being repaired, I think, like, after he smashed her or whatever. He's a bit of a freak. He also, like, sells drugs and stuff. Dinner is ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. So, like, why would you worry about, like... Like, your android judging you? So what, how do I do this? Oh, it's just down the log pole. Down the log up. Yeah. It's pretty strong. Come on, off you go. They're hungry, man! All right, I'm moving. There wasn't Jeez. much in the kitchen. I did what I could. Music is amazing. Yeah, I have audio this week, which is quite fun. Here is your food. Come over here. Here is your food. Yeah, something messed up's gonna happen, basically. Turn on the light. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna turn on the light. Go and turn on the light. There's something else you could do. Serve Alice and Todd. So I'm gonna serve oh. Todd first. Some water. Life's funny. Okay. I lost my job because of androids. So what do I do with this? You turn it left isn't it? They might need somebody to take care of this goddamn house. What the hell? What are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing! Go out and hire a fucking oh, okay. android. I see. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm teasing him. I'm like, oh, are you gonna help? None for you. Uh, of see you later, Ed. So well, could fucking he? wonderful. Whoa. You wanna watch yourself? They never huh? fail. They never tired. They never sad. I will knock you out, fam. It's so fucking perfect. They ruined my fucking life. What? Maybe because you're a drug addict freak. Yeah, I'm waiting. You know, you know. What's your fucking problem? Hey, don't talk to your daughter like that. Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. No. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. Yo. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Okay. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Okay. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account. It's all your fault. Daddy, no, no pressure, but it's your fucking life. fault. Oh my days. Where's the knife? Get back here. Come back here. Her. Come back here right now. Gonna be cutie fantastic, get ready. Okay. Get out of there. You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move, or I'll bust you worse than last time. Go the fuck up the stairs. Go the fuck upstairs. Go the fuck upstairs. Go move. How move, do I move? Move. move. You break your programming! Do it. L1, what does L1 say? Go. What's that mean? Oh, you're gonna push through the wall or something. Push through your programming. Do it! Come on! I'm going to break the wall, women! Save the girl! Save the girl, save the world! Here, bro. Good. You 
broken your programming. Get the fuck up the stairs. Well, let me discover my new powers. My Dragon Ball Z. Protect others. Sorry. No. Forget. Forget that guy. Forget that guy. Go get the Go upstairs. Get out the window. Go, go, go. This is Ted. This is Ted. This is Ted. Oh no, follow her down the place. Where did she go? She's just went over there. Shit. No, no, why are you going in there? That's his room. We don't need to go against her. So maybe there's a gun in here? No. No? I don't think so. You need to open a window or something. Get the hell out. Get her out. Get her on the door. Open a window. Get the hell out. Okay. Open a window. Is it open? He's coming. He's gonna hurt me. Run! Get away! Or he's gonna break you like last time! What? Run with Alice. Run with Alice. Run, run, run. Coming with me. Go! Come on, lady! Daddy's very mad, Alice! Go! No, no, get the hell out of the window! Get the hell out of the window! Oh, mate, he's not gonna. Oh, which. I don't know. Uh, oh, no. Okay, we might have walked. I can't remember. Oh. What? I don't know what happened. Okay. Fucking Brad. LT. It's all her. It's all her. Fucking fault. Get the pen out of the window. Come back here! Yo! Go, go, go! Go, go, go out the door! No! Uh, what? How do I fight? Oh, go, go, go! Get out! Down, my days! God, this is so stressful. Get away from her. Get the hell out, get the hell out. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 Oh my god! That was deeply upsetting. Oh my god. I'm um, Lord T making no notes, my first playthrough. Hold her hand! Wow, that was. If my it was in the room, he'd just kill me. She's a bloody serpent! I don't care! She doesn't have stabby knives. Any kind. No! Update later. I don't want to update you. Update later. Dude, come on. So look back. You can look back at the different decisions you could make, right? So what does that then? Um, it means that there were other options within the game. Um, we fought our way out. There are options where basically... Wow, look how many options there are. What's that one there? Where's it? Todd, Todd realizes Kara and Alice. Go, are go back that way. So where does it break? Where's the where's the pinch point here? Get to Alice before Todd. Okay, so like, look, look at all these different ones. Kara becomes deviant. Todd gets mad. So that's it. You know, so break this is where it happens. So this this is the point where there where I guess you either try to reason with him or you go upstairs. Okay. So then Kara runs upstairs. She goes upstairs. So then there's a bunch of options. Oh, what's the other? Wow. Maybe I could have killed him. I swear I could have got a gun assigned. Hide in the corridors. That was really tense, guys. That was like super tense. Um, you've re Todd realizes Kara and Alice are gone. Run to the backyard. Wow, this is amazing. Look how many options there are. Yeah, they won't all necessarily mean the same thing as well. Some will come to the same place. So like, if you look back, let's see how many go through to that one. Kara and Alice fight their way out. That's okay. one, no, there's two different ways that could have happened. Yeah, I two different lost ways. That. Catch the bus uh, and something else. Or I could have, I could have gone. Whatever that else. other end one. Escape yeah. via. Oh no, escape via yard. Is that what we did though? We escaped via the yard, yeah. But we, but then it could have gone but to then somewhere else. If we are, oh, but if we didn't manage to climb over the fence, maybe then that's just basically death. And if we don't manage to catch the bus, then maybe that's death or something. Oh man. 
Ooh. Oh, Darth Super. It ended very differently in the gameplay I've seen. What's the one that you've seen? Spoiler, there is a gun. Why didn't I find the gun? Well, let's just be glad that we got out. Yeah, that's true. God, look at that. Look at that. Is this like if I didn't serve them food? Break programming. Oh, no, that's a break programming. Okay. Disney. God, that was that wasn't a really. Can I just say that was like super intense? I was. I'm actually sweating. Well, you were sweating earlier. No, but that made like me really, sweat. really sweat. Oh wow! Every option ends in death. Wow. You don't want to spoil it, Darcy. But yeah, I just yeah, heard I, that a lot. I feel like every option ends in death. That was really close. It's really interesting. Um, that was terrifying. So, I mean, it's great. It's got great replayability. Because, obviously, there's a lot of these kind of games that get into trouble because they're like, oh, actually, how much do you really influence like what the characters do? So, it's really good of him, I think, to put that there to show actually everything. Because, like, instantly, you're like, I want to go back. Like, I want to go back and play that again and see what happens if I've done something differently. Yeah. Because you know that there's alternatives. Yeah. And you know that there's options. And, like, so, obviously, we're, like, 27... Com- 27% complete on that level so we could theoretically go back and 100% that level by doing every other option wow my god but it'd be interesting I mean I don't think we should do it right now um, same as my play flu was slightly different oh. that's crazy that it's so different for everyone that's that's really cool <laughs> every option ends in death he meant that as a joke I mean there are a lot of death bits no leave me alone updates god. leave me alone we don't need your updates so are we ready to continue I feel like we are. I feel like we had enough time to... Yeah? To kind of de-stress from that. Do you want a Mr. Freeze? I have some. <sighs> Not yet. Okay. Resume. Right. So then you'll like this other hand. Let me do this. Oh, it's just teams a bit. Buggered. Who is also, what's his that face from um, Lance? That was the most boring <laughs> party I've been to in the last 25 years. But basically there's segregation between these, I ask myself, like their AI and normal What the and hell the am I doing here? I hate at the cocktail with parties. AI. And all the like that go to the kind of Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to work. meet you. So there's yeah, a lot yeah, of yeah, No one gives a damn about art. Right, oh, sorry, Android's not cyborgs. All they care about is how much money not. they're going to make out of it. Come on, let's have a drink. Oh, the excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. So when we were here last time, we were just helping Scotch, you. neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say? Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough <laughs> to choose my own medication. Right, right, Oh, Doll Super, uh, found you through the outside Xbox crew. Ugh. Yes. Uh, Jane and I have known each other for a very long time. Did you in fact, she's one of the first people I studio? spoke to in gaming back no, in the day. No, I'm sure I didn't. Oh, no. What's happened? Oh, oh, please. Call. Detroit Police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's Android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break in. Uh, Corgan Drifter TV. I think out. he was in the X Files, wasn't he? Was he in the X Files? Yeah. Was he in Millennium? I didn't watch Millennium. I don't want to take him with me because this don't guy. Don't take him with you. No, because mad stuff's gonna happen. Basically, what happened when he was here was Marcus, his son. No, I'm gonna come with you. No, don't take him with you. But I'm an android. I must follow my my master's orders. Wow, you're really getting into this, like. Wow, this is really dark. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Um, so last time, like, the sun came along, basically. Face the other way, yeah. Mike. Um, it's gonna get ugly. How do I let go of this guy? Now? I don't know, you're stuck with him. Oh, so God basically, damn his, it, Mike! His son came along and was asking for money, and he was like, no. And he's he's quite sweet to him. He was asking him to paint a picture. <gasps> this guy won't leave me alone! Get him off my hands! Get him off my get hands! Off my hands! <laughs> okay, sorry, guys. That must be really annoying for people. Um, yes, Lard Team Maker is right. He is Bishop in Alien. Oh, is he? Yeah, oh, right. with the hand thing. Okay. We can do that now. Do that live on stream. The stabby hand thing. Oh. oh. Everything's kicking off now. Leo! Oh, okay. We know. What are you doing? It's his son. You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them. <laughs> Look, they're all going to be mine sooner or later anyway. I want to fight. Think of it as a down guy. payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from Thank there. You. Get him out of here. Make Leo leave. Come on, Leo, man. Let's just. Um. 
Gonna... Oh, you got you got time. Uh, advice, advice. You're reasonable. This isn't gonna get you anywhere. It's quite time All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? No. He's actually Perfect. jealous of the android. Like this fucking thing. That's enough. Get out right now. What makes what? it so special oh. anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't? Leave him alone. God. Yo, don't hit old people. Come on, let's see what Bro. you got. Ah, uh, come on, man. I don't want to fight you, brother. Don't defend yourself, you hear me? Don't do anything. Brother, come on, man. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one. Stop it! What's the matter, too much of a pussy? See, it doesn't Stop conform it, to, like, gender stereotypes. Stop I hope he's scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! Oh. God. Okay. Okay. Right. Do it. Hit him. No. Do it. No. Do it. I'm not gonna hit him. I'm not defending myself. No, no, I'm not gonna defend. I'm not gonna defend myself. I think kind of the point of this is you do this. God, why do I have to do this? I like the way it's like a literal representation. Oh right, that's right. I forgot. You're not a real person. You're just a fucking piece of plastic. Oh, Oh. oh, come on, man. Oh. I'm destroy you. Your brother, your dad's dying, man. I tell you what, nobody's gonna give a shit. I'm gonna, sorry, guys. Nothing. I'm not going to You hear me? Outside. You're nothing. Because right. if we attack back, we lose. We lose, guys. Uh, 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 uh. We lose. Oh, my God, he's dying. See? Yeah, but he's come dying. Come on, no. Okay. Oh, Carl. Humans, fragile machines. Carl, don't leave, okay? Please don't go. Don't I'm crying. Leave. crying. Remember, Marcus. Don't let anybody tell you who you are. Okay. No, no, Dad. Oh. No, please. Oh, this is all your said. fault. What? This never would have happened if it weren't for you. Really? Oh, he's gonna throw him under the bus. The android. Who's the android? What? What? Dude! Okay, that's not good. No, we don't want to update network features! Although maybe if he had, he wouldn't have had so many problems. I guess that's an option. Leo, go back and look at the thing. Maybe if we'd broken our programming earlier, zoom in. There's a different ending. See, I could have checked the studio without the guy, but it still would have ended the same way. Obey Carl, you don't obey Carl. What? Carl dies of a heart attack. I couldn't have, no. I think you I'm could, not I dead, right? I don't think you're dead. Do you want an Iberian ham crisp? No. You eat those damn crisps. I don't want them. This is amazing. Yeah, also Darcy, but you're right. Why would why would you have a function? Why would you build in the function of tears to that's an true. android? Yeah. You know. Yeah, he had the red circle of death, that's why. Stop it! I'm not updating. You gotta update your stuff, man. I had this on the other day! Like it shouldn't be needing an update. It's my fault. Uh -oh. Why'd you kill him? What also, they should be able to tell. What happened if he took the knife? Oh, right. There was no oh, knife. Oh, right, right. Sorry, this is the first story. Oh. That's what's his face from. How long were you in the attic? Oh, really? Yeah. Why didn't you even try to run away? Is he an android? Say something, goddammit! <laughs> Fuck it, it I'm out of here. Let me talk to him. We're I wasting our time interrogating a machine, we'll get nothing out of it. No, you do You always <laughs> try ruffling up a little. After all, it's not human. Why do these people feel pain? Hi, Neil Vegas, how you doing? And that wouldn't make it talk. 
Wasn't he at E3, this guy? Wasn't he have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> oh wait, he's in... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We have to lose. Thanks. Go so ahead. Like the game so starts off where he's trying to save this uh, android's being replaced as part of a family. He goes crazy and is going to kill this little girl by holding her off the edge of a building. And you have to basically talk him down. Right. But how you talk him down, like you can kind of manipulate him. It's kind of a bit weird. It sort of plays with your morals. And like, if your only agenda is to save the girl, you basically do anything. And it's quite harsh, really, actually, what okay. you'll do to kind of get the result that you want. I want more of those, like, Little orange things, they were good. Those, those, those chocolate oranges? Mm. They were. Oh. Take a look, because also if the more information you take, the more, you, more options you have. I see. So like in this first one, you go around the house and you, um, so it unlocks another line of dialogue or something else. Look at everything you can in the room before, if there is anything else. Um, so like when you go outside and you question this guy, you can piece together why he's doing it. So you can then say, I know you're angry because they're going to replace you because you know that that's why. I think that's basically it. Okay. We should have got, I should have got more, more than our whips. Cool. Okay. I'm going to analyse this guy. Analyse him. Five clues to analyse. Oh yeah, there you go. Process Software in instability, probability, self-destruction, low. Okay. So he's not going to kill himself. Wherever the triangle is, basically. Dry blood. Okay, so that's somebody's blood. Fighting days. That other triangle. Hit marks. Non critical damage I'm doing by baseball bat. Wow, he got hit by a baseball bat. Well, he was basically being tortured. This guy was being abused. Yep. There's one more. Bat. Carlos and Porto. Yeah, who's basically fighting back. Interrogate. So we're gonna have to answer some quick fire questions now. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready guys. Let's go. Reach optimal stress for confession. Okay, so we've got to antagonize him. So also it was saying, um fear, show photos, wounds or name. My name is Connor. We wanna antagonize him though, no? What about you? Yeah, but we don't want to make friends What's with him. What's your name? We'll get there. You don't know my name. Yeah, but you're reducing his stress. Okay. You've got to antagonize. Fear. I detect an instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant feeling, like fear in humans. Threat. Blame. Yeah. You're accused of murder. You know you're not allowed to endanger human life under any circumstances. Do you have anything to say in your defense? Oh, too low. Okay. No, 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 I'll get him, I'll get him, I'll get him, I'll get him. Probe his memory. If you won't talk, I'm going to have to probe your memory. No! Yeah. Ooh, no, please don't do that. Oh, what's that? Huh? 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 Got something to hide? Huh? What? What are they going to do to me? We're going to probe you. They're going to destroy me, aren't they? Yeah, truth. No. Why would you know you're trying to make him They worse. just want to understand. They know your master abused you. Look! Don't worry. It wasn't your fault. You're doing it the wrong way. Why did you tell him you found me? Give me some time. This is how I play my Why couldn't you, you only just get so many questions, me? fool? I missed the question. They were going to find you anyway. I was just faster. If they'd have found you first, you would have been shot on sight. I don't want to die. Threaten him with death. Then talk to me. I... I... I can't. Oh. Okay. Okay, you want to play that game? Okay, you want to play that game? I'm going to choose my approach. Come on, I'll choose it. I'm going to you leave me no so. choice. 
Sorry, bro. Ooh. Someone do it. It's like Twister, but with it's like you need some help. And then square. Okay, level of stress is quite. I high. access its memory. I know what happened. It's... I, I feel like... There's nothing else we can do here. That's it. There you go. Apologetic. Apologetic! I had to know. You left me no choice. Go. Oh no! We pushed him too far. Fuck! It's, it's destroying cool. itself. Oh, God. Dude! Stop it! God damn it! I, I, I can't! I, I can't stop it! Intervene! Intervene! Stop. Intervene! You need to stop that right now. No, don't let him go, you idiot! Idiot! Oh my god! What oh my just god! happened? Oh my Shit. god! Wow, that did not go well at all. You were terrible at this. <sighs> Dude, you just killed the main character. <laughs> no! My god! We don't want to update anything! Why does it ask you twice? <laughs> Everyone's just like, whoa! That was... You're the worst at this. Yeah, I am terrible at this. Can we replay that level? Yeah. Can we? How do we replay, can we know. replay can that we? level? Can we? I don't think, <laughs> no. No! I don't think you can. Or maybe you got to complete the whole game first or something. Okay, so we're back in... This is a different one. Yeah. Guys, I can't... I did not... <laughs> no one saw this coming! Oh my god. <laughs> Little different to how a lot of teammakers won't work. <sighs> wow. <laughs> is it even possible to be good at this? Thank you. See? They understand that I. you don't have to be... You know, it's hard to be good at this game. I'm trying. This is amazing. But this is why you was. It gave you. It told you what you were supposed to do. You're supposed to rattle it enough to confess, not like probe it and fuck its shit up. He wasn't playing. My boy, you know, he was like. I, I, I can't. So I had to break him. Go on, your turn. No, no, it's quite alright. Listen, I am. Str I am. Li I'm not. I. I am so stressed right now. I just got shot need, in the head. Do you need a Mr. Freeze? Because I can get you cool one. Cool whip. Cool whip. Let me get you a Mr. Freeze. Okay. Right. It's meant to play out like that. He's an android with memory stored, so he can come back. <gasps> I hope so. I hope so. It's the last time I let you come and play on my bloody PS4. Because otherwise, yeah, I'm just screwing up your story. You're screwing up the story. All that hard work. Well, that like hour of gameplay. Wow. Well, guys. Champs? I'm. What? Do you want some champs? No, I'm alright for now. I've got to say, guys, this is a. Uh, this has been. Crazy fun. Shall we continue? You can continue here. I'm gonna go pee. They're okay. a bit big. So people can't hear me. Down, 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 Maybe this is fun. Maybe it's not. Maybe you just want to see the game. Let's play the game. Okay. Some coffee. Everybody.
everybody loves some coffee. We all want some coffee. You want some coffee? I want some Lady, we're gonna leave the bus. We beat this guy up and be like, Let's take the bus. No, yes. stay here. No, we're gonna find some shells. So this guy looks like, Do you know if there's him. any other place we Why? can spend the night? Because he's a man. I no idea. Okay, She's gonna have to leave. Okay. Bus check. Gonna be okay? No, she ain't. We gotta find the shelter. We'll find this is like the night. this is like the pursuit of happiness for a darker android female version. Really? Yeah. The spelling annoys me. The pursuit. Of happiness. Yeah. They spell it. Come on, Alice. We've got to hurry. Let's spell it with a Y. Yeah, we're not gonna go to that. Let's go to Burger Zone. Yeah. There's shelter in burgers. Nope. Okay. Nope. Well, I'm just gonna temporary park. Here. I'm just gonna park myself there. You can find your own shelter. Ha! <laughs> I'm funny. What about the coffee place? Look around. Okay. So, so you've got we a store. Have a a drugstore? Uh huh. Shop, shop is closed. That could be good. We have a. Is that a, mo a motel? Whoa. Coffee place. Oh, no, no, no. So, is it coffee? That's a coffee. It won't be a morning. We'll open before morning. Okay. Of that other one over there. Wait a second. We have a comfortable Couple, but not discreet. You'll need money. Okay, fine. That's fine. This is uncomfortable but safe. How to get in? I'll do that one. All right. We've got open twenty four seven. Can't peep here. Ask for help. Okay. Oh, what, what's the other one? There's a parking lot up there. How about the drugstore? That's what I want to look now. Check motel, no, check house, no. What's this place? Yeah. Open 24-7, can't stay, but it's a dryer. Could get some change from there, maybe. Someone might have left some change there. I think we could break into that house. You break into the house? Yeah. Okay, what's this place? Very uncomfortable, but discreet. We're on the run, then. Guys. What should we do? I'm going to get hit by the bus. <laughs> Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I cross the road and that bus hits me. And that's like one of the choices in the games. If, if there's a way of dying, that's obviously what you're going to do. I ain't robbing no damn store. Who do you think I am? Okay, we're gonna rob a store. Right, we're gonna go to the 24 7. We're gonna ask for some money. No, this guy... no, you can't. Because I report them to the police. Wait, what's she doing? Go across the road. The hell is this girl doing? Hey! Hey! Why are you. Give me your goddamn hand. What are you, what are you doing? Little girl. Wait till they've gone. The hell is she doing? Oh, God. We need to wait till they've gone. Wait, 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 till they're gone. Don't let them see you, because they're evil. Hit me! I can't do this anymore! I just can't take it! Hit me! Stop standing in front of the bus. Okay, fine. Uh, 
I'm okay. I'm not so cold. You look lost. No. We have nowhere to go. Why are you telling him the truth? I know someone who can help you. What's going on? But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. Freeze to death. No, no. I'll do this. Alright, we're doing this. We're gonna sleep in the car, okay? Alright. Oh god, this game is gonna make me feel so stressed. Yep. What if we find a weird hobo in the car? Yeah, but we're like an android, we can just like mash them up. Can we not go in the building? It looks abandoned. Don't run the window. Oh, sorry. Stand back, Alice. Oh god, why am I doing this? 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 Yeah! A weird hobo just jumps out of the car. I've never been in the car. Okay. It's dry inside, and nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. Can't we find a better place? Stay here. Okay. No. Better. She is a tiny little girl. We need to make her. Yeah, but she needs to understand that if she gets caught, I can't ever go over you. You need to be like you're staying here for tonight. And that's it. Why are you listening to a small child? She doesn't understand the complexity. No car. House. Okay, fine. I'm gonna go to the house. What house? Which house? Right in the corner. Yeah, the one in the corner. Maybe we should go to the drugstore. Why is anyone in the drugstore gonna help you? Is that the police? No. <laughs> Look, the store is still open. Maybe we should go inside. Yeah, Maybe we can. Cold. Maybe we can. No, I don't want to find some help. Convince Nasha no. to help. No, he doesn't trust androids. Oh God, this game is so stressful. Maybe we can steal some food. No, we'll get caught. I'm gonna talk to him. What do you want? I'm with a little girl, and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? A homeless android? Ah, that's the best yet. Look, this is a convenience store, not the Salvation Army, okay? Fine. You better go if you're not gonna buy anything. You bet. I'm not gonna steal. I ain't gonna steal. I ain't gonna steal. Because that's not my thing. What's the L1 about up there? What? What's that about? Oh, so that's a camera. So that camera will be able to get us. So now that we've been in this place, okay, you know what? I'm not gonna steal anything because then that. Oh, God, we shouldn't have been in here. Oh, wait. Hang on a second. I think is that to buy wire cutters to break into the place or not? Oh no. Or maybe if we go back to the house. Oh, I'm gonna need to, 
take the wire cutters, aren't I? Gotta give it half on the point. Maybe I should go to the um, the drugstore. Why are they gonna help you? There's drugs. Bye, love, tea maker. The Bye. girl's behind me, guys. Okay, don't worry about it. She's fine. Okay, we can't go right now. Go to the house. Okay, I'm going to the house. Where's the house? Is that the house really? I think so. Yeah. Come on. Little girl. Huh. <laughs> That's funny. Where's the entrance? Oh yeah. Turn to the right. To my right. Mm -hmm. That's the left. Oops, sorry. I think it's in there. Really? There's nothing more this way. Okay, let's go down there. We're going left across the road. Right, we're going to cross the road, guys. Look. Fine. No. I'll be a hell of a lot of now. This was 100% an option. I don't know why. What? Okay. This is stupid. I don't like this. Look. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night and no one will look for us here. I trust a car more than a freaking house. Okay, we've got to do, do the Wi-Fi. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay. So we need to go back to the convenience store. Oh, gosh. Right on it. It's just right on us. But who's um? Oh wait. You, oh wait, wait, wait. Yep. Can okay. you move Does while that's happening? Of, does it come out of shot? No, it doesn't. Oh, <laughs> the impending death is giving me. <laughs> what? <laughs> the impending death is giving me stress. Okay. All right, guys. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna steal it. Okay, I've got an idea. All right. What are you gonna do? What? I didn't even mean to do that. But let me just look at them. I'm looking back at the do do. I'm going to steal them. Get the fuck out of there. Go. Do 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 do. Go. Why go, go, go. Steal? Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm stressed. Oh my god! 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 Where do I go? Where do I go? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Where's the little girl? I know. She'll figure out. Camera sees all. They're gonna see that I stole that, and then the guy's gonna but, be like, but "You took my daughter." Yeah, but she's gonna get beaten up anyway for hitting that guy. I should have just hit the car. Should have just shut that girl up and be like, "You know what?" Go get further down. I know it's not comfortable, but you just gotta stay in the car. Should have done that. Should have just stayed in the car. Okay. But basically, whatever happens, we're gonna get in trouble with the police. So actually, stealing something doesn't really matter. Mr. Freeze, it's huge. I don't know, it's massive. It's really hard to make it Oh, I think there's wire cutters lying around that he didn't have to steal. Hmm? Oh, Are you alright? Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. Oh. Why did I just steal? I am supposed to be a good human. Poor oh girl is gonna die because of me. Yeah. 
Don't worry, we're just having a look. That guy should have just given me some damn money. What do you mean we're just gonna have a look? You just stole a convenience store. What if these are druggy house? Yeah, we can get in that way, surely. What about we'll get in? What? The other way. No. The other way. Can we climb up there? Can I climb? Oh, let me see. Come on, little girl. We're gonna climb. This is why I keep climbing. Yeah. Just walk around the other side, no. This is the more idea ever. Oh, what was that? Oh, no. Okay, that's not gonna work. This is the worst idea. Oh, okay, look, look, look. Make sure there's not anyone weird in there. Okay, there's a door on the other side. No. Never through the front door. Always yeah, through the back. Know. Alice? What? Oh, come on! Alice! Are you serious? Are you... Are you serious? Where the fuck she gone? Where did she... Well, she stopped at this door. What? Wait, oh, what are you doing? Yeah, Whose idea like was this? Ralph doesn't like visitors, they're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. I don't know what the humans did to you, but she had nothing to do with it. All humans want to hurt us. But Ralph won't let them hurt him again. No, he won't let them. We thought nobody was here. All we want is a place to spend the night. Visitors are dangerous. No, man. Look. What they did to Ralph. So you'll be safe again. Come here, Alice. <laughs> I ain't fighting it. This is so stupid. This is so stupid. We have to find somewhere. Anywhere. Oh, just a place God. to spend the night. Hang on, Alice. We'll find something. I Go promise. Go back to the bloody car. Yeah, Put her in the that's car. That's it. I'm, we're going in the car. I don't want to get in the car. You're going to have to take it. Got well, it. do you want to get stabbed by Ralph? Exactly. No, get in the car. Jesus, it was so much more easy if we just wanted to... Now I've committed theft. I'm on freaking camera. Ugh. Oh. Hey, Braiders. Just we are good. Just committed to that now. Yeah. Car seems a lot better now, huh? Get in, get in the fucking car now. Are we going there? No. You just hiding in the corner? Yeah, yeah you, you do, do that. that. <laughs> Yes. Do you want to get stabbed by Ralph? We're better off staying, Alice. The important thing is for us to be safe. And it's just for tonight. And we know where to go tomorrow. So hopefully you don't die tonight. Yeah, but like, all they've got to do is like a fake place for tonight, right? So. If that Ralph guy comes to my car. One more up. Why is she destined? Don't be destined. I'm Please. not. Okay.
Why didn't funny. he ever love me? Aww. Why was he always so upset with me? Because he was a douchebag. All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. That's why he was always so angry. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? The drug addict? I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? I promise you'll never go. Promise. I promise. Will we be together forever? Forever. Forever. I mean, let's be honest, she's probably gonna die. But like, that's forever. This damn is too stressful. You got too many emotions in you, boy. This kid. No! Shut up, PlayStation. Oh my god, look at the Jesus, options. Jesus, look at all these options. So. So I think there's an eventuality where you can actually stay in the squat then. Inside Not the supermarket. Talk to clerk. Notice cash register. Yeah, so I could have done something else. What's this one? Steel cutters. Okay. Inside parking lot. It's like squat. Meet Ralph. Yeah, I don't trust Ralph. I didn't trust Ralph. I mean, even if you convinced him, would you really want to stay in a place with stabby Ralph? No. No. Robert really wants us to update this thing. And we're back in the room. Thanks, Sony. What's this guy saying? So it's normal David Cage controls of being really strange. Yes. Okay. Dope meal Ralph gives you? What <coughs> meal? Damn it. What? I talked Ralph around and found cutters. Oh, what? Interesting. Are you serious? Yeah. Yo, I can't play this game. You are really bad at this. I'm just, I'm just making the worst decisions. I've been shot in the head. I got shot because, and I didn't fight How back. How are you in normal life? I, in general. I'm terrible. Oh, are you? Terrible. Can you function in normal life? No. I can't. Really? What's the stupidest thing you've ever done? I mean, aside from come on this stream. Yeah, eat those stupid things. What? Meet you. Meet me? Yeah. Worst thing ever. <sighs> what are we doing? Okay. No. Right. Well, we're not dead. So no. You didn't so, kill anyone. But she's so... going to hate me. What was the other option? We'll stay in the motel. Maybe I could have stayed in the motel, but then I would have been in. Then I would have had to convince people. We did the scenic route playthrough. <laughs> Mm. Ralph makes breakfast? Stabby Ralph can't argue with your logic. Are you serious? Oh, what? See, we should have stayed with Stabby Ralph. I don't trust the, the guy was gonna. Well, it's taken a bit of a turn, hasn't it? How's your Mr. Freeze going? It's going great. Give me the controller there, I think. You, you have your Mr. Freeze. Okay. Uh, this is how sweaty is this controller? Because it's a oh my terrible God. game. It's a horrendous freaking game. <sighs> Stabby Ralph is good, but confu a confused egg. Man. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, is this me being shot in the head? I don't know. Yeah, it is. Oh, dude. Reboot. Oh my god, we're not dead. Alright. I really want another self that's going to be terrible. Oh, we are fucked up. Oh my god, we got thrown in the bin. I'm going to turn Terminator. Oh shit, huh? Okay, I want to analyze some clues. Okay, that. Corrupted audio data. Oh, this is really fucked. I've got 
have a corrupted mind. Palace, how about you? They shouldn't make them so good looking. This guy's a bit too good looking. He'd both be used for sex. No? You wouldn't have sex with your animal. No! He went damaged! Not now. Oh, I'm with him now he's damaged. You know? But when he was like, you know, peak. Tap that. Tap that. Can I tap that? You're on English, Dad. Well, there's loads of us here, look. So we're gonna replace your legs. Thanks for explaining the plot.
I'm begging you, please. And then. Yeah, and I don't want to live anymore. Kill him. Kill him. Not. Kill! He's sick as kill him! See, because he's got one blue eye and one green eye. In, in this game, he had two. Hello. I'm an AK-700 android. In this game, he had two green to eyes. Through. Now you're gonna get. What can I do, the Jesse? Jesse? The Jesse? 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 My program has detected an anomaly. Please contact me near the satellite maintenance center. See, now my guy has two different color eyes. Someone. There's like a shitload of stuff here. Oh shit, this is gonna be our only option, isn't it? Exactly. Oh man, that's dark. Watch. Incompatible. Oh, man, we're gonna have to kill that one, aren't we? Yes, we don't have to kill that. <laughs> I am heartless when I don't play. Because. That's the way, that's what it is. I don't have to live with the bird. That's, that's the thing, it's not my bird. So, I bear with 
Let's kill the girl. Just I'm saying. Gonna kill that girl. There's got to be another one. I'm not gonna go do that. Give her up. Oh, that can't. Look how many parts there are. For real. Go on. Go kill her. No. Okay, someone says they think that Katie says, not someone, Katie, she has a name, says that there might be another one. There's something over there, I can see it. I'm not going to kill that woman. Katie, I think that sometimes people should. She wants to live. Okay, to, so so that you could live, you would kill another person. Oh. Okay. Would you would you do that? Oh, but look at this guy. Come on. Look at him. Look at him. I don't want to die. Find the slope of dead bodies. It's like something out of the killing Robo Jesus lives! Robo Jesus lives! Look, his, why is his face so handsome again? All he's of a not hand, He's not. He just got a handsome face all over again. Come on, bit of a hose down. How about it? Do androids grow beards? What's he doing? I will take this knife. T-pose. What, rip off what? Oh, he's going to take his little thing out. Sorry, mate. But he won't be able to live without it. Yeah, I mean, it must do something functional, right? Ew. That can't be a thing that happens. Because surely when they all do that. We still got some abs, though. He's a robot! I totally. But who cares? Do they have penises? No, look. Wait, I need to check. Hold on. No Look at the abs, they're serious no abs there. Look at that. There's plenty of abs. There's abs for days. Like a great cheese on those abs. Marcus. Is it? Yeah. Okay. There's definitely Look at that. there's definitely Oh my god. He's a penis there. Really cool. There isn't. There was definitely a bulge there. there his pants. Definitely. He's like action man. 
Julia must watch Westworld. No, Julia is a full-time member of Westworld. I'm there <laughs> every season to straight up have sex and... Look at that. There's so many options. So you could have Yeah, but everything leads to him coming back from the dead. My name is Market. My name is Market. Like, everything occurs. All right, I'm going to go pee. That's lovely. Yeah, we need to wrap. Wait, can you... We can wrap up in a minute. Oh, okay. the next one. Okay, analyse self. That's me. Lying in a junkyard. Analyze self. Who about Jericho? Um, okay, so I think we should probably stop about there because it's like getting to ten we don't do another thing and I think I've... You've done enough murdering of my in-game characters I think to last a lifetime. Basically. Yeah. Yeah. That was fun. I mean... I enjoyed that. Yeah. The, my favourite part was... The bit where Marcus said, Dad, no! And it wasn't his dad. And the android cried. And then he came back to life and he was like, My name is Marcus. As an actor, just shut up and read what's on the script. Okay. That's no one's asking saying. for your opinion on that's anything. What do next time. Yeah, that's what I'll do next time. Yeah, just do your job. Yeah, well, Connor I'm died sorry. a valiant death. You antagonised him, so he shot you. Well, he shouldn't have freaking... She should have just said that he was abused. It's like, come on, mate. It's like, I can see you. I can see that you're abused. So why didn't you just say it? Because you're trapped here. What are you going to do? So just say it. No, He's you dealing forced, with you some new emotions. Just because you're sentient. It was like his first week at being sentient or whatever. whatever. So he's dealing with some, like, you know... Feelings and emotions and stuff. Well, Just because you have too many feelings and emotions, you've like come to terms with it. Because I am Marcus. <laughs> so I've ultimately regret this whole experience. Anyway. This was really fun. Yeah, it's really fun actually. Snacks were great. Snacks were good. Um, did you enjoy having him on the stream? Say no. Enjoyed. You enjoyed. You enjoyed me on the stream. I don't know. It's like a really long pause. I'm waiting for, an for them answer. to to come on. It was yup. See. Okay, they did. one person liked you here. Yeah. So there. That's good. Why have I got these headphones still on? I don't, I don't need know. Them on. What I do need are snacks and sex bots plus special guest awesome. Oh, Katie oh. says she loves you. Thanks. They said yes. Have them back. We did. Says never Lucori. He was okay, guest maybe, says I make stuff. Oh, DZ Womble. So this is Abu Bakr Salim. He plays Bayek in Assassin's Creed Origins. I play Bayek in Assassin's Creed Origins. You didn't obviously you didn't do that voice. I didn't do his voice. That's what I do. You're going to find out why that helmet is used the way it is in a minute. <laughs> um, what would you like him to say thanks for the moist evening what would you like him to say as Bayek as a goodbye and then he shall say it and then we shall end the stream what should he say as a goodbye and he can say it as Bayek because obviously yeah. you're clearly like a performing monkey here to obviously that's, that's exactly yeah. what I do now there is a helmet okay helmet I can't say helmet do you mean to really say helmet that's really you've got you've got the accent All the things that he could say. You want him to say helmet. helmet. <laughs> Don't hurt rap. Say. Uh, Marcus is Bane. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hurt Ralph. I think is what you're trying to say. Yeah, Eggit. Thanks. Ha. Jules was shit. Steve can shut up. Shut up, Steve. Bayek, Bayek. This is ridiculous. Bayek, Bayek. Polish my assassin's helmet. Pl oh God, that was horrible. Yeah, don't say that. Sorry. What? So what? This is ridiculous. As Bayek. I am Marcus. <laughs> oh, those snacks made me high. Really? They were weird. Wow, well, you're a cheap date. Okay, I think we're gonna go because he's gone really weird. <laughs> And um, I think maybe he should leave now. <laughs> yeah. It's like the mask. So 
I bet you thought, like, I was a weirdo, but I've been sitting next to this for, like, two and a half hours too long. Obviously. Anyway, thanks very much for having us. We'll be back. Well, we, I will be back. Same time, same place next week. Him probably less so. It's a really awkward way to end the stream. <laughs> Sorry. Um, All right, I'm going to stop, guys. <laughs> I'm just... <sighs> Nerd. Nerd. Right. Thank you, guys. You guys are awesome. It was really fun. Thank you, Julia, for having me on board. It was great. All right, we're going to go because he needs to take this helmet off. I really do. I'll see you same time, same place next week. Bye!